people call Trump racist because he uh, is his words are getting t- uh, taken out of context. But real well, racism. They suppress um, like the, the video. There's about three or four videos of him saying I condemn white supremacists. And, yeah, three or four. Yeah, El Paso. And that, uh, yeah, yeah. And the average person I speak to who does who hates Trump genuinely never saw them. That, that, that clip has never reached them. Why is that? That's concerning. It's the same way with Hunter Biden's laptop, the same way how no media is talking about the fact that Hunter Biden is having sex with 14 year olds in China. That there's that, video evidence of that. There's no evidence of that. I didn't even know about this. Yeah, there's video evidence of that. that that's why Biden, want, Biden and the Democrats want to win so they can continue selling our intellectual property to China so they can get rid of all this evidence. Because, you know, Hunter Biden's a drug, he got kept in the military. And he walks around on FaceTime with a 14-year-old girl naked. His family knows about this. They've known this since 2019. They've had this laptop since 2019. Jesus. But these corrupt individuals keep denying it. I heard he also has allegations about him touching the niece or something. Probably. I, I wouldn't be, you know. I, I, I always remember that, that in the, in the, there's some 4chan leaks. And apparently one of the girls is his, his own 14-year-old niece, which is, uh, you know. If pedophilia is in that family, I would not be that surprised after all the little girls that Biden's sniffing on camera. <laughs> I mean, well, there's got to be 20 clips of Joe Biden sniffing girls, little girls. It's terrible. Yeah. yeah and you know what's weird, too? So I've noticed this among colleges, amongst college students. Um, these topics are not touchable. They, what they, the universities have done is made it so that these topics are not touchable. They are trigger words. And the person, instead of discussing it, gets angry. Have, have you noticed that at all? Yeah. Yeah, people, people just get angry for no reason. It's People don't know how to have a civil discussion anymore. They don't want to listen to the facts, and people just want to believe what they want to believe. Like, That's true. I'm, believe- I'm not even a political podcast or guy, but um, I, literally, I will let anyone debate me because I, I believe in my values. And I think also a lot of people get focused on, and you can comment on this because you're into the politics, I'm looking to get to the truth rather than prove that I'm right. Mm-hmm. No, I, I would rather have the truth. Like, if you tell me <clears throat> reasons why Biden is better than Trump, you know, maybe I'll consider revoting, right? But when I see the fear mongering that takes place, when I see Kamala Harris and Joe Biden want to implement the 62% tax on New York, when I see Kamala Harris and Joe Biden uh, keep flip flopping on their policies, when I see, when I hear from my parents and other individuals who lived in socialist Poland saying the same stuff with the mask that's going on right now, is the same thing that was happening in 1968, you know what I mean? Yeah. I, I'm not going to vote for somebody that's going to take our economic freedom and financial freedom away from America because I'm not, not going to do that. The, the one country, leave it alone. If you don't like it, you can go away. And it, with civil discourse, people just don't know how to speak anymore. My, my whole goal with political drop in is so we can have a discussion, but nobody wants a discussion. I can show you evidence i can show you facts i can show you i can disprove all your claims i remember i was having a conversation with someone about you know trump and racism that, that, that's the most common one the easiest one trump and racism oh he's racist because of this nope disprove he's racist because of this disprove disprove why is he so racist i don't know he's just racist i'm going to come back and show you more okay you can show biden supporters about corruption with hunter biden how corrupt the entire system is how he gets 10 million dollars and joe biden gets 20 million dollars how joe biden lives in a house with the net worth of insane million, mega million dollar house on a salary of $274,000 a year, people just don't want to believe it. They still think Trump's the evil one. They don't care. 